So you might be in this random situation where for some reason your particular iPhone is telling you that you're having problems with the true depth camera that you have on your particular iPhone. So you might be going into your settings application and you might be seeing some problem like this, which it tells you that you're having a problem with the true depth camera. Now, if your face ID has been disabled and if you're running into this problem, the number one issue that you're having here is because this camera at the top may actually be a third party camera. So it may not be a first party actual, you know, full authentic camera that Apple put in. It might be a third party one. So if you recently cracked your iPhone, if you sent it to somebody to repair like a third party you know, random store and they didn't use Apple genuine parts, that could cause some issues and the camera may actually just end up being turned off. Now, if this was a fluke, what you can try doing is restarting your iPhone. So you can just go through, hold down the buttons, the volume up button and the side button right here to restart your iPhone. Go and slide the power off. That could very well end up fixing the problem for some people. If you do that though, and that's not working, you can also try updating your iPhone. So make your way into your iPhone settings application. You wanna scroll down until you see general, which is right here. Click into software update, and you wanna go ahead and try updating your iPhone. This is another thing you can do to end up fixing the problem as well. If that problem is still persisting, there's a few hardware things I recommend thinking about. So if you did recently change the camera on your iPhone and you went to the Apple store and fixed it, well, you may just wanna call them back and let them know the issue that you're having because then they'll go ahead and fix it for free and they won't really charge you for it. If it was a third party store that you actually ended up kind of replacing your front camera with, well then in that case, I'd recall, recommend calling them, seeing if they use genuine parts and seeing if you can get it replaced with an Apple genuine face ID from the front camera. If none of those things are true, you may have recently just cracked your iPhone or you dropped your iPhone and the camera at the front may actually be faulty. And in that case, I'll probably recommend contacting Apple and letting them know about the issue and seeing if you can get the screen replaced here. So those are a few different ways to go and fix the problem. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, not me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything, I also love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.